Good afternoon. Today, my topic is capacitor. This is an old capacitor. We don't know how much capacitance it has right at this moment. So, we have to do the necessary testing. So, what is the procedure of testing? At first, at first, we have to uh, calculate, uh, measure the supply voltage. So, right at this moment, what is the supply voltage and current? While we will charge the capacitor, at that time, how much current it will take, that has to be measured. So, finally, capacitance in microfarad for a single phase alternating current supply voltage to 30 and 50 hertz. In that case, formula is 3150 into ampere divided by voltage. Voltage means supply voltage. So now we are going to test what is the voltage and what, am uh, what amount of current it will take while it is charged. Let me start our practice. It is a clamp meter, digital clamp multimeter. So I am measuring the voltage. Right at this moment, what is the voltage in this area? So I have put it in voltage option, alternating current and red prod to be put in phase and black prod in neutral. Switch on. It is showing 200 and 211. 211. So voltage is 211. I am noting it down here. Yeah. Voltage, supply voltage 211. Now current. How much current it will take while it is charged? And this lead I am putting in fade phase and this is in neutral. Now clamp meter to be set in ampere. I have clamped on phase line. Now switch on and it is showing 2.661. Two point six one six two. Finally, it is showing six two. Now I am discharging it. So this is the current taken two point six two amps. Now I am putting the data 3150 into 2.262 divided by supply voltage 211 is equal to 8253 divided by 211 finally the answer will be 39.11 microfarad 39.11 microfarad but in this capacitor initially microfarad was mfd was 50 now it is near to 40 so 20% MFD or capacitance has been lost. So this capacitor is not fit for the respective system. So capacitor has to be replaced. So uh, when you have a capacitance meter at that time easily you can measure but 
while we have no capacitance meter at that time by a simple calculations we can measure the capacitance hope you people can do it easily so okay thank you next time i shall show for what kind of motor what capacity of capacitor will be required how much mfd will be required for 1 ton 1.5 ton 2 ton uh, uh, ac and uh, particularly uh, we capacitors capacitance depends upon almost its horsepower or wattage so next time in my next video i shall show the how much capacitance of capacitor will be required for a particular motor okay thank you thank you very much